Tonight, our big story at six, much of Kansas rocked by a magnitude 4.4 earthquake this afternoon. Happened around one o'clock, centered in Harper County, and it was followed by a smaller one about 30 minutes later. Some people there reporting damage. Our Annette Law is live to take us inside one home, and she's got more. Annette. That's right, guys. You know, down here, a lot of discussion about all the activity, including on our Facebook fan page. And one of the people that have been pretty active on there invited us into his home and take a look at this. So this is David, by the way, and he said that um, inside his home, it really just rattled him, the earthquake itself, and also just sort of inside, he was a bit shaken by everything that had happened. Um, he was in his office at the time when the Timbler hit, and he was working on the computer, and then suddenly, some collectibles started falling off the shelf. I mean, in past times, walls might have been shaking a little bit, but nothing fell off. Uh, in the living room, my wife observed the uh, television, which sits on, on top of our ent entertainment center, was swaying. Uh, she wondered if it wasn't going to walk off. So. And David tells me that in the future, he is considering that possibility of getting earthquake insurance. I know a lot of people on our fan page today also discussing that as well. And just so you guys know, I've done some stories in the past on this. Um, a lot of providers do have coverage um, for earthquake insurance. What you need to do is to get in contact with them and discuss that possible policy change. Reporting live in Harper, Annette Lawless, Cake News. All right, good information. Thank you, Annette. Digging deeper now, counting the two earthquakes today, there have been a total of 62 earthquakes in Kansas this year. Now, most of them were around a magnitude of two, as you can see on this graph here. Now, 60 of this year's quakes have been in Harper County, where they only had five in all of 2013. A quake on Tuesday, by the way, it was initially reported as a 4.1, but it was downgraded to a 3.8. Now that makes today's shaker the first one above 4.0 so far in 2014.